Oh, help. Oh, no. It's a... What is it? It's a gruffalo! Seven-year-old Posey Hover is taking part in the first ever Long Shot the Moose Day in Saratoga Springs. This is a day where kids can meet local authors and hear great stories. As he peeked over the door, I said, how were you able to fit all of you into my little stable? I like stories a lot. And um, the more I read them, the more it's more exciting and I learn. Vicki Adesso Dodd created this fun reading event after the city declared June 15th Long Shot the Moose Day in honor of her award-winning book. Today is a day to celebrate Long Shot the Moose, which is actually a book series that was inspired by the moose that got lost and wandered onto the Saratoga Springs racetrack. It was on this day in 2009 when that lost moose happened to show up at the Saratoga race course. People couldn't get enough of this bizarre visitor. This moose made everybody so happy that I wanted to write a story about it. You used a local event as inspiration. Yes. yes. So Vicki wanted Long Shot the Moose Day to do just that, inspire. She created this fun meet and greet with 11 local authors who set up reading stations along Broadway. It's not a day about selling books. It's not a day about um, getting the word out. It's a day of reading, helping kids fall in love with reading and inspiring them to just be anything they want through reading. Anthony Rikiki is one of the featured author illustrators. He wants kids to know that they can create books too. Definitely want to inspire kids. I remember meeting um, authors and illustrators that come through my school and they just seem larger than life, you know? So to be in the, their shoes now is a huge honor. So it, it's, it's cool to come full circle like that. As the kids strolled from author to author, they learned so much more than great stories. Kids like Posey learned anything is possible. It's just really exciting for me. Did you ever think about writing your own book? Yeah. And to know that, hey, you wrote a book, I want to write a book. Write a, it doesn't make a difference if it's good or bad. It's a book, it's your story, it should be told. And if this day inspires one child to do that, it's worth it. So I couldn't ask for more than that. Julie Chapman, Spectrum News 1.